spotted from space, Yolo County has been caught releasing global warming gases by a new surveillance satellite orbiting above Earth. That's pretty fascinating. Tonight we're getting answers on where the plume of gas came from and why California is spending millions of dollars to prevent methane from escaping into the environment. Two, one, ignition. The state of California now using a satellite to spot greenhouse gas emissions from space. Tanager 1, deploy confirmed. And one of the first problems it pinpointed is in Yolo County. The view that you're seeing um, is a mountain of garbage. Trucks dump tons of trash each day at the Yolo County landfill near Davis. All that waste is buried underground where it produces methane. As your garbage degrades, it is producing that gas. Landfill director Marissa Jeweler says the facility has more than 150 extraction wells to capture methane so it doesn't escape into the atmosphere. There are greenhouse gases like methane um, that really are detrimental to the environment. But now sensors on board the state's new satellite spotted a plume of methane gas leaking from the landfill and drifting over nearby farmland. It, it is a little bit like, oh shoot, right? Like, gosh darn it, th th it, we got caught on satellite. Landfill crews actually spotted the leak a day earlier, which was caused by a broken well cap. The problem is now fixed, but they say it shows the value of using the new technology. There could be landfills out there that are not doing the proper monitoring that definitely need that extra oversight. The California Air Resources Board is spending $95 million on the methane monitoring satellite. And landfills are the second biggest source of methane in the state. Last week, the board also released more stringent methane monitoring standards, but Yolo County has some concerns about the cost. It could be an extra dollar on your garbage bill each month. It might be an extra four dollars. We don't know. The state's new regulations and space-based surveillance are part of a goal to reduce methane emissions 40 percent by the year 2030. If the state finds it and it's detected, we're going to fix it. Also, what happens to all that methane? Yellow County actually sells the gas to SMUD, where it's used to generate up to five megawatts of electricity.